Oh no! Get in there! Get in there! <laughs> oh no! Ah! No! Why can you be too small? Seeing this, cut these two holes exactly the same. Not enough fit. Guess I should have checked that before I nailed the board up here, right? It's not going to be any fun. Damn. That was a really pretty hole. Fine. I don't care. It's in. It'll never come out, but it's in. have arrived at our infestation destination how you doing today Ray are you concentrating you should like probably look at the kitchen before you get too far here it's right here that's right like oh it's right there yeah oh the other one's still here too it looks just like the pictures Uh, 
Yeah, that would make sense actually. Howdy. Howdy. How are you today? Good, good. I'm good, thanks. I had to pause this time lapse just to show you guys what we're looking at here. Oh, it's got the soft close. drawers not a lot of drawers is like this one <clears throat> this one I mean this one set and then well, I guess there's some other drawers here too Susan? Susan, why are you so lazy? Okay, so actually there are a lot of drawers. There's drawers in all of these too. And uh, there's the kitchen. Oh, what's in here? Oh, all the, uh, the shelves. Okay. And this is... Oh, look at that. What on that one? Yeah, it looks a little rusty. Yeah. I like it though. I like it. It feels like... Like, better than I thought they were being, do I have to like uh, um, seal this with something like a, like yeah, no, a clear coat of no, something? Yeah, it's, it's, yeah, it is. It's, uh, like it, said, it already is. It's better than I thought they were going to be. To be honest, like in the pictures, they look rougher, but uh, they do, yeah. But here, they're actually very nice, very smooth. It looks like you'd be snagging or something, but no. Yeah. I like the finish on them. Yeah, I do too. All right. Back to the top. Okay, Ray, what's what's the plan here? Well, we try to kind of tetris it all in you know like it should all fit but uh it's going to take a little bit of uh playing around so all right we're gonna put all that in there what do you think time lapse you can do time lapses yeah you can time lapse all right let's do time lapse
Ray has done this before. I don't know if you can tell. I got kitchens. One more. Pretty full. Yeah, I think we can get those. The rest of the pieces right up here. Yeah, that's pretty full. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Yeah. <laughs> we got it. <laughs> I told Ray several times I could get some pieces in my car, but it's almost like Ray's like, nah. It's like the Grinch packing his sleigh, and he just gets really in there and throw it up. Put a piece on top. <laughs> okay, I guess we're. You want to grab something to eat? Sure. Right. It's eating time. I haven't, I haven't eaten. I haven't eaten today. Because I have no kitchen. <laughs> I have no kitchen in in which to prepare food at the moment. Well, I mean, I do. It's just a mess and it's really dirty. Do we gotta check with the dude before we go? Do we gotta? I hope he's driving like he's got a kitchen in the back. Most of the stuff has been removed, except for, um, so on the north wall, the, the wall that faces the pond, yep. uh, the countertop is still there, right. sink is still there. We still use it, yeah. Well, uh, for now, yeah. I was thinking we take that apart, right. and then we take the pieces in that go on that wall, and we put them... Well, that would be great, except that those pieces are on the bottom. He says, that would be great, except those pieces are on the bottom. Sorry, am I not speaking up enough? Uh, yeah, just, it's just the wind. Yeah. Unfortunately, the way we had to pack it, all the base units are on the bottom. So we could take them out and put them somewhere, but then we got to put them back in, and it doesn't look like it's going to rain or anything, but um, I know what you mean. It'd be nice to take the ones in as we use them and install them as we, as we do it. But I think what you're saying is we got to take those two big ones in first. Well, or a lot of the little ones anyway, because all the little ones are packed in there too, so those little ones are going to have to come out too. So right. um, I would say like one big one and two little ones packed inside it and uh, okay. you know, I'm well, not sure how many trips it's going to take but we have a lot of cardboard anyway that's good yep yep judging by the wet mud on here <laughs> well this is this is the thing so the the worst wet spots in the trail the, the plywood wasn't underwater at all which is good. nice good but you can see that yeah um, there's some spray but you got some plastic I see so that's yeah, what the plastic is for there's a lot of spray yeah and this is not too dry it's from today, I'm sure. It was wet. Yeah, of course. But I'm just saying it was from today. Yes. You don't have a broom or anything. Eh? No, I didn't think to bring a broom. Okay, uh, where's your impact? My impact is on the people that watch my videos. Ah, yes. They don't do as <laughs> Russell does. <laughs> Let Russell be a lesson of what not to do. I have a <laughs> profound impact that way. <laughs> Oh my god, what's Russell doing now? Bets. Hmm? Bets. Oh, pretty much how we left it. Well, oh. Over, but so you know why? Because this is package. this is Ray Impact. <laughs> this isn't Russell Impact. <laughs> Alright, uh, you want to take this up out there and then put this one on? Maybe you want to back your trailer up here too, unless you like carrying it stuff. No, no, I could probably, um... Yeah, yeah, okay. Well, we'll do it. Yeah. You can do it the hard way if you want. No, 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 I'm, I'm just... <laughs> I, th I thought we were going to take the other big one first, but... No, we got to take this one out first. All right, first okay. In, first, or last in, first off. All right, I'll bring, I'll bring it around.
Ray is wondering if we should fill up the whole thing. And I'm thinking maybe the first trip we uh, try and take it easy. See how it goes. Put that one piece on and some other pieces inside it. And... Okay, so like, is there any branches up here? Like, obviously this came through okay, but is there any yeah, thing leaning over like this or anything? Or? Not that, no, anything like this high is going to be fine. Okay. All right, well, let's get this one on. And uh, I think we can still put a couple in beside it without going too crazy but it's uh i've got well, ratchet can, straps too so we can, we can certainly put it off to one side if you want to put well that's what i'm saying it was like this okay. one only this one's taking it here so let's put it like here and then you put a couple uppers okay. Okay. and a couple inside too like you said okay oh wait wait wait, wait. <laughs> sorry <laughs> do we want to how do we want to do the vapor barrier on this Wait, what are you doing this? What? Am I supposed to get in there and, and grab this? Yeah, reach over that end. <laughs> no, get on the side. Get on the side. Come on, what? Get on the side. <laughs> <laughs> reach further in. What do you expect me to do? <laughs> reach further in. I'm reaching. All right. There we go. There we go. Let me just set it down for a sec. Let me just put it right across the trailer. Okay, I'm just, okay. Okay, you keep going, that's good. Where go? Oh. Gotta yeah, go for this way though, right? Yeah, we don't, we don't, what? Hmm. What? Yeah, okay, go ahead. We don't want it hanging over the edge, that's all. Which edge? This edge. Okay. It's, you can hang over a little of that edge, but... Yeah, okay, that's fine. Well, hold on. We gotta figure out the vapor barrier. Oh, you're gonna staple it to the bottom of it, aren't you? On the other way, so you scratch with the branches. A little cardboard in between. Yeah, that. <laughs> and you don't have much mud on it either. You know what's funny is, I kept envisioning, like the whole thing was supposed to be 27 pieces, and I yep. kept envisioning 27 trips. <laughs> I was never envisioning that. <laughs> <laughs> that never crossed my mind. It's almost like that. I need to move it forward like four inches. <laughs> you lean it up. So it's more likely it's going to slide back than forward? Yeah. I mean, it might slide forward too, but then you can't put both on both ends. It's too long. stuff on one little Is it too, too much weight? <laughs> too much oh. weight, then, you know, it's not a big deal. I can... Is it too much weight? It might be, but you want to try it anyway and see? It, you've done this more often than I have with this uh, trail and this ATV, so... Well, 
normally I would say uh, this would be fine. But without the front, without the front wheel drive, oh, yeah. we might have some challenges. Okay. I mean, well, I mean, the worst, the worst that can happen is we stop somewhere, we, we take some stuff off. Sure. You ready for the vapor barrier? <laughs> You're still putting stuff in. What's our panel count? You're still putting stuff in. What's our panel count? We got one, two, three, four, five, six. So at 26, that's only do six loads. <laughs> What am I worried about? <laughs> okay, we're, we're, we're gonna have to strap this with the yeah, yeah. Strap. yeah. Tighten the ratchet straps a bit more, but it seems alright. Alright. So what are you? Doing? The input card we're in. This is going to be a problem right here. Uh, we need to get hardware between this, the, the face of it and that edge oh. there. Move by the rub. Yeah. What do you need to do? I don't know. Pull? Oh. Separate the things. Can't grab anything. Yeah. Okay. Not much. Just a little piece. Places like here they could bonk up against it, but well, there's probably with this. Yeah, this part here. I don't know if there's something in there. Hmm. But yeah, she's a good sleep in there. I'm just imagining this thing like being slammed around a hundred times, which yeah, it was probably not an exaggeration. I've, I've certainly taken 300 pounds before. Okay. Um, again, it's just about the front wheel drive. 98% of the trail is going to be fine. 98. The other 2% is why we bring Ray. <laughs> Do you think it'll help? As long as you get up onto this. There's less of an incline than going onto that, so probably. I don't know. No? Here, you take this. Well, you know better than I do, so do you want me to slide it over more? Or? No, let's just try it. I mean, right. we, need this, we need this end to sink down a little bit, I think, but it might do that as soon as we get there. Okay. <laughs> Ray, Ray wants me to go back and f <laughs> so we can film this again. <laughs> Apparently, my instructions on how to press record on a GoPro were not that good. Uh, yeah, it worked. We got up there. No mud on the back, which is good. There's a cooling on the front, though. Hmm. Yeah, that's not good. Well, no, did any get in this hole? I, a little bit. It's all sealed, so like it's. You can wipe it off with a wet rag or whatever. Yep. It'll be fine. Okay. 
All right, maybe we'll soaking it. Maybe we'll record the next obstacle. Sure. Better.
Dan and Rick are, of course, working on the outside of the cabin. Uh, I was thinking that we should start with this wall. We could take out this whole countertop. Okay. The ceiling is done over here. The walls... The only thing I don't know if the 33 is going there or the 36. The 36 we have with us, the 33 is on order. So, we just got to review those drawings. I'm pretty sure it was that corner that was on order. Good, good. Okay, so yeah, we can like basically start in this corner and work out in both directions. Yeah. That would be good. Okay. Um, <clears throat> and what are we doing on those pipes? Uh, they're going to come down through the cupboards. Okay, and they're going to come down through the, like, where the backsplash is? Yep. Okay. All the way down. Okay, well, I guess you can make a little chase, a little wood chase or something around them, too, to hide if you want to. Yep. Um, all right, you've got the PEX joiners and stuff like that? Do you, uh, yeah, I do. Um, okay. The only thing is, the one on the far left, I measured it out, it's exactly 24 inches from the corner. Okay. Uh, which is, I think, is exactly where that... It is, yeah, it is, yeah. So we can chip out a little to the left of that and yeah. just move it over, maybe, okay. just enough. Yeah, because it's a 24 by 24 here. Yeah. So you're right, move that over. Um, and they're going to go down underneath the cabinets, obviously, and that's where yep. you're going to come around through your supply. Okay, yep. got it. And your plumbing's already there, so we're not moving the sink the same where it is. Well, um, we'll have to do something with the sink. Well, I know, but <laughs> your drain's there. Yeah, hopefully we don't have to change any of that. you got hole saws and stuff, right? Yeah. Okay, it's not a good one in the van. Yeah. Um, the power for the stove, how long is it for on that? Can we just move it over, or do you got to... Uh, it should be fine. Oh... Yeah, we'll we'll see because the 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 gas line also comes out through the bottom. Oh, yeah, okay, I forgot the gas line. So we'll have to. Okay. There should be a, there's enough line for it to move over. It's, the gas the gas line copper. No, no, plastic? it's it's a uh, plastic. Okay. Okay. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. We can start with it. And once we as soon as you get the cabinets there, you're not running any through that one. You can load that up. That the lazy Susan. Oh. <laughs> do I ever want to load up lazy Susan? <laughs> I just want to stuff her. And you did a lot in that thing, so. Um, I've got to clean it first, but. Yeah, you know, here we, there's still some work to be done there. You know, load that one up, but all the rest of them. So, yep. in that corner unit. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Get rid okay. of some of that crap. Now, of course. <laughs> Look at this this place. Yeah, you have to clean up for me. <laughs> <laughs> I want to say, it took me so long to empty the kitchen and put it all over here, <coughs> but only because. I still wanted to have access to everything, ignoring all this. I still wanted to have access to everything, and yet not cram up. I, I still need to be able to move about the cabin. Kind of has that hermit look. <laughs> it, we're calling it the Russell look. Oh, okay, okay. Just, just rebranding. <laughs> all right, let's go check and see what, what what we damaged. Yeah, unfortunately, none of what we brought in is what we need right now, but... Oh, well. I was thinking about that. What a single piece. <laughs> well, it's like, this stuff had to come off the truck and kind of... Well, it had to go on the truck in a certain way. So last in, first out. In okay, I'll be out in a second. I'm going to get the dog some water. And she never looks where her paws are going. It scares the hell out of me. Yeah. Alright, so shall we take a look here? Yeah, a couple of close calls on the way in, I think. And, uh, well, actually, you're pulling closer than a close call. we got a rub down here. It's like a tree rubbed across there, and it, uh, I, is guess the, I guess some duct tape back at the house. For back the, there. What happened so to the, the cardboard that was there? Uh, I think it was rubbed off, because you can see a rub all the way down here, like it was scraped along a tree. Oh, I think it rubbed, it took cardboard off, too. Son of a golly. Hmm? Well, that's the, is this the bottom? Or is it the top? It can be either. This is, this, this is, these are the uppers, right? But, but it is the back, right? It's the back uppers, yeah. So okay. It's fine, it's just that uh, we did scrape a tree there. I well, didn't see it, but... It wasn't me. <laughs> I was leaning the wrong way, I guess. All right, can we just kind of, uh, like, open it and then fold it open, and then we'll check for damage? Sure. Take off the uh, ratchet scratch. Yeah. Turn on there. Yeah, 
got a little tiny rub here, but that's not bad. But yeah, that's from, I'm sure that's from rubbing up against there. Might have been before we put that cardboard in though. But hmm. That's the worst there is, and you're doing pretty well, I think. Mean. Oh. It's underneath that. All right, okay. So. Oh no. Oh, let's get back. Okay, well that's, uh, that's it. Well, Ray, your cardboard game is on point. Mm -hmm. I wish we had the uh, printout so we know which ones we're going to use, because if we're not going to oh, use them, it'd be nice to take, put them in the garage or whatever. A little rubber right there. Yeah, rub there. In the corner, not the door, but the, not the door. Oh, here? Ah. Did I do that? Oh, yep. Shh. That's okay, you won't see that. <laughs> just, just the blood now. <laughs> yeah. A little blood. I guess know. the disadvantage of using natural wood is you can't hide stuff with caulking. Hmm. Normally, That's... like when you don't have it all the way together, you just hide it with caulking, but you can't do that with Could you, could you use like wood filler? I do suppose. A little rub there. I don't know that's from. I don't think it was there. That's not us. I don't think so. Unless it was from the truck. But yeah, all right. Ah, it looks good. Yeah. Okay, let's now figure out where, where to put it well like i said if um if you're not going to use it in there is there any other place to put it like this 30 30 i don't know if the 30 30 is in the plan i okay well we'll, we'll go check out the plan um stuff like uh <coughs> i've got a printer's office in a great big 24 by 36 too i forgot you didn't have a printer i don't have a printer um stuff that we're not going to use or we're not going to use right away on the deck I'll move the okay. swing out of the way and we can put it there. I can't leave it out there for too long because it will swell. Like the plywood will swell because the edges are not sealed. Right. So. Okay. Well, what's okay, well we are using this one. We know that's going to go inside. Yeah. Have to open the door and everything. Can, you want to take, well, we got to well, pretty much have to take it. Well, let's, let's take a look at the picture. If you want to just quickly draw it out, maybe. Yeah. And, uh, we'll see. I don't know where that hutch is going, but... Does that go right to the ceiling? Yeah. Does the hutch go right to the ceiling? Uh, pretty close. That's why I said, like, fortunately you got the center spot. Otherwise, we'd have a hard time standing up in here. That's going right, right here. It's, uh, it's just on the inside of the fridge, right? Yeah. Where the ceiling is finished. Yeah. Um, well, as, as long as we can still move it. Yeah, yeah. Well, like I said, because you have this, it makes it a lot easier. Because you are 96 inches. For me? It's 96 inches. Here? Or pretty close, yeah. Uh, 8 foot 3, is that 96? Oh, okay. Oh, that's 99, but that's fine. So you have a little above it then. Yeah, actually, my, a little bit shy of 8 foot. That's, um. Uh, oh, anyway. There. Okay, it was me. I put all those rocks. <laughs> Are you the answer? He's a rhetorical question. I'm gonna fall over my ass. It is. Which is the bottom here? I got the bottom. Okay, we're gonna come this side. Okay. Those pieces, I created a lot of space.
Oh wait, sorry. Okay, bring it up. Ready? Yep. You balance it there for a sec. Yep. Let's just walk it back. Yep, okay, stand her up. The dilemma. The big cabinet that we don't even need. The big cabinet that we don't even need is really in the way. And I just want to leave it here for now in the truck. But it's on top of everything we need. But it's on top of everything we need. So we need to remove it, take our stuff out, and then put it back. Because yeah, it's so easy to move. Because it's so easy to move. <laughs> I said, Ray, if you could just hold it here for a couple of minutes while I move other stuff out. But how heavy is it? It's like 200, 200 pounds? It's heavier than the last one. <laughs> it's, it's 30 inches wide. No, 33 inches wide, I think. So it's heavier than the last one. All right, all right. Let's stop talking about it and just do it. <clears throat> We're going to carry it back there then, I guess, or? Well, I don't want to go too far with it, no. but... Well, I guess we can put it down here, because uh, the other pieces are small, or... Oh, well, yeah, yeah we just, let's just stand in the park right here. Uh, I don't think it was... Maybe it was there. I knew it would. I knew it would work. Look at your ears. That thing, that thing threw cabinets at me. Here's the sink. I need that. Um, if I want to lay the whole thing. around this thing too, cardboard, just so it doesn't slam back and forth. Cardboard, pack cardboard. What, yeah. what is this maneuver called? <laughs> well, I'll try to get as many pieces in as possible for a trip. This right. is going in. All these pieces here that we're taking in right now go on the the that north wall, the wall that's facing the pond. Not facing, but closest to the pond. We're trying to get as many pieces as possible. Because if we we can actually if we get all the pieces, then we can start building that side. I don't know what I'm saying here. I'm pretty tired, actually. Ah, load number two. Uh, card boarded up. How many pieces we got on? We got one, two, three, four, and I think five, six. I got six. Oh, you know what we never did, though? That. There's smaller pieces in both of those cabinets that we never 
did anything with. Not right, anything on the cardboard? There's cardboard in there, but it wasn't meant for this kind of trip. It was just for the van. Well. I'm gonna take a chance. It won't damage the pieces in there. There it is, go. Alright, I'm too tired. I'm too tired. It's 5.09. No, you're just not on the trail. You're not, you've, the one wheel came off the uh, pallet. Okay. Winching. All right, winch, I guess. How long? How long a thing do you have? It's pretty long, but. It... We'll get to that one over there. Or is it that ten-inch one? Right. Almost time to drink my own pee. <laughs> the Bear Grills way. Get over here. Get out of the way. No mud on the... No. That was a pretty muddy one. There's Unpro mud going everywhere, so... Unprotected piece, yeah. This side? Um, is that mud there? I can't tell. We'll just wipe off as long as it's a uh, lot right there. Uh, oh, well, it looks okay. Oh yeah, let's get out of here.
<laughs> something I wouldn't have done on my own. And we missed it on video. so much fun. We might, Ray, might have to start here. I, no, I know, I'm thinking of, I'm thinking of that. Oh, I hope you do your whole trail maintenance here. Nice start trail though. Yep, it's a good, it's a good saw. Mm -hmm. I watch this, this water start winding. I assume you don't have a second saw with you, so. Well, hell no. Even if I did. Uh. <laughs> no, no, I mean, if I get this one bind wound oh. up in here, what will do that? I got an axe. Oh, yeah? Hmm. And you'll, uh, you'll learn your rum and coke tonight. Mm -hmm.
Well, that turned out to be a nightmare trip from hell. The load was so top heavy that for a lot of the trail, Rage walked beside it, ready to push back if it, if it tipped over. And we didn't bother filming it because it was just so annoying and it took forever. What time is it? What time did we leave? It's 6.43 it's oh. now. Yeah. Hours we, we left here at 5.09, I remember saying that. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, we got some damage. Hit, hit, a, hit a tree. Hit a tree. Well, it's at the back, so we should be able to... It might not be visible from the inside. We can fix it. Well, if that's the worst that happened, did we yeah. catch anything here? No, no, I think we're okay there. I was worried in between here, but it doesn't look like it. got lots of cardboard in there, so... Hopefully it didn't. Uh... All right, we're we're gonna unpack and see what we see here. I'm so tired right now. Ooh. articles that I read, yeah. they always talk about this drawer where you just throw everything in it. It's the catch-all drawer. Right? And, and I, I laughed because every place that we have lived in, we've always had that kind of drawer. I've got like six of those drawers. Six? Oh my gosh. Let me see my best drawer. <laughs> And so I feel that we will have one of those drawers, maybe two. <laughs> you really can't find your glasses? Okay, anyway. <laughs> Oops. So the camera is... Okay, well, as you can see, City Girl is here. Okay, so the settings on the... Settings of the camera are all wrong. Anyway, um, I'm currently editing this video. It's over an hour long, and I feel that this is a good spot to stop. Next video, we will start with the kitchen installation. As you can see behind me, a bunch of it has been installed. It hasn't all been installed. City Girl had this to say when she first saw it. Oh my gosh. This is like a totally brand new kitchen that I don't even recognize. So very exciting. Um, I'm sorry we didn't get to it in this video. As I said, it's just too long. If I start in on the next segment, the video will be another hour long, at least. We did. We took so much footage, and we had so many people comment and say, "Russell, we want to see." Is it really bright? On this? It looks like it's really bright. I, I I think I got the settings all wrong. I'm really sorry. Anyway, we had so many people say, Russell, we want to see you picking up the kitchen. We want to see you hauling the kitchen in all its glory detail. I said, yeah, okay. It's, you know, it is what it is. <laughs> so you get to see all of that. Um, also, can you see that? They can't see this. <laughs> can't see what we're trying right here in the middle of the kitchen. Yee. Gosh, we might have to wait two videos for this. We got so much footage. I don't know what to do. Anyway, thanks for tuning in. We'll see you at the live stream. <laughs> the girl's laughing at me now. How's that cherry gin smash? It's absolutely amazing. It's amazing, is it? Mm -hmm. Oh, excuse me, absolutely amazing? Yeah. Very good. Well, we'll see you all uh, on the live stream Friday night. We'll be there. Uh, if not, we'll see you in the next video. Peace out. Thank you.